and welcome to the Nexus for issue three of our Ecto build. Now I'm going to do this in stages because there's, as you can see, there's quite a lot there. Um, so from going forward, I'm going to be doing uh, stages. So in this issue, we're going to be doing issue three, stages one and two that are in here. And that's how it's going to be from now on. Uh, so it gives you something to view, uh, just because I think if I did the whole issue, it would just take too long. Uh, but anyway, so I'm going to start with issue three, part one. So just like I explained there, um, there is quite a lot here, as you can see. So we're doing um, stages. I'm going to call them one and two. But it's, it's three and four basically in, in the book. But uh, we're going to do the tyre and we're going to do the bottom part or, or the bottom bumper part of the uh, front grille that we had before with the fog lights on. So without further ado, let's crack on. Okay, so this is stage one. We have also need our number plate as well for this. Uh, we've got the, um, the part the number plate goes on. We've got the front bumpers here and the fog lights and the screws. So let's crack on. Okay, so first bits first, we're going to fit the number plate in, just like so. Making sure that this is the top, this bit's the bottom, it's the right way up. And what we're going to do is we're going to put a couple of these uh, BM screws that we've had before, just in the back here, like so. Let's just uh, grab that. And it goes on really well and there we go so that part's done and it looks really nice as you can see so let's start on the next part okay so these are the parts that we need this is the left hand uh, side or fog lights so the lenses go in uh, just like so just like that and then these get put in individually so uh, L1 will go in this side and you can see the L in the inside there I'll just uh, zoom up so you can see the L in there so that's the left so L we've got L2 here which goes in here and L1 which goes in the other side and we're going to secure that in place with an AP screw so that's what I'm going to do now okay so I've gone ahead and done that on the right and the left side as you can see they're really nice so now what we're going to do is attach them to this so now what we've got to do is just secure it here with uh, DP screws just two into here then we're going to attach it to the bottom of this just here with uh, DP screws as well. So I'm going to go ahead and do that now. And there we are for this stage. And I'll tell you what, this thing's going to be an absolute animal. It's going to be a beast of a car. And it looks really nice. Obviously, I've, I've, I've seen all the complaints about the fog lights. They do show working on the magazine, but they, they could easily come out later on in another issue. Though the lens is... Um, have the little lights in um i'm not really that bothered to be fair so let's crack on with our next bit so in this part we are now going to be doing uh our second part for this issue or stage four in the magazine so that's what we're going to do now so these are the parts that we get uh the hub cap and the cap that goes in the center we will put aside we will not be needing them in this issue uh, the tire itself is really nice very detailed as well firestone deluxe champion we've also got uh made in usa and the tire pressure and the whip and stuff like that's normally on a tire which is really nice so once again it doesn't matter which way it goes around we're firstly we're putting in the rim uh this is die cast so that just sits in like so and then we are fitting the back of this to it. So this just sits in. We'll line it up. Making sure it's all uh, lined up nicely. Then we're going to use the CM screws that we got with it. 
um, just to secure that in place. So we're just going to. It's all about just squashing the tyre down to make contact, just so they are in and they go in like so. They're fairly easy once you squash it a little bit. Uh, the tyre is rubber as well, which is nice. There we go. And this one. Also be careful of the... Um, the little gate. The, um, the little... Uh, that, that there. Be very careful with that. Obviously that will go over that eventually. But obviously these will get put on... Um, so be very careful that it comes through just there. Obviously, they will go on at a later date once the wheel is secured onto the car. But that is it for this issue. Um, thank you for watching, and we'll see you at the next issue.